Hi Michael. So this is a reply video to your video on vulnerability hangover. And I actually had to watch it twice because at the first time I thought you were talking about something completely different. And I guess you'll understand now because the same exact symptoms that you talk about. So back pain, not feeling like you want to do anything, laying on the couch the whole day, waking up later than usual, happened to me like the same exact things, but on a very different scenario, like not on vulnerability, or at least that I've experienced it yet. But in the last year, I've learned something about myself, which is I feel those symptoms when I don't know what to do. So, and this is kind of weird, but I'm a very methodical yet unorganized person. So I like to achieve things and know what to do and the steps that I have to take to achieve what I want to, what I want to make. And so when I get lost, when I have like a, a big task that I haven't yet broken down into small pieces that I can actually start working on, those those things are happening to me and that's when i procrastinate like the times when i procrastinate are like easily identifiable the times when i feel the worst and the worst like mentally physically everything i, I just know that if i start procrastinating i'm gonna start to feel like shit. but somehow i still do it i'm still trying to figure that that part out <clears throat> but yeah it was really fascinating to watch your video because you mentioned uh, the exact same, the exact same thing you feel when you're vulnerable. I feel when I'm procrastinating or when I don't know what to do. And th th this part of knowing what to do is something I'm still exploring because I know it is somewhat related to having a, a big task that I don't know from where to tackle. I'm experiencing it right now with a, a situation. Um, but that for, for some reason my body doesn't feel compelled to go after and actually break it down. Instead, I want to lay in bed and eat junk food, which makes no sense. So yeah, it was it was it was good to hear another perspective on someone that that this happens to. Um, and yeah, I guess you mentioned that it is somehow related to a physical. What did you mention? It was a physical constraint also related to your your mental state, and both get released at the same time. And I guess that's also true for me, but I'm still learning to to like actually have the motivation to go after the big task break it down and continuing to something i don't know this is just a a ramble about a personal situation that you you discuss in your video and yeah would love to hear your thoughts on w what happens to you when you like set out a goal but still don't know how to figure it out how to actually break it down does it happen the same thing or or doesn't